One of the great things about Candy Crush, Jelly Saga, is that it's a sister title to Candy Crush and Soda. It takes place in another part of the Candy Kingdom. It starts out with our heroine, Jenny, who's a little Yeti girl. She's the niece of Mr. Yeti from Candy Crush Saga. Her journey starts when the Jelly Queen kidnaps her uncle. The Jelly Queen has an overarching plan to create a Jelly World. This was actually the main inspiration for our game and for the Jelly Queen. They were laughing at us walking out of the shop because they'd never seen someone buy so much jelly. When designing the Jelly Queen, we had to strike the right balance, make sure that she was still likable as a villain. When you lose, she'll come onto the screen and throw jelly in your face and laugh at you. Cupcake Carl is one of the hench creatures of the Jelly Queen, and on the side he likes to wrangle pufflers. Pufflers live in the mountaintops with Jenny, but they've got a bit of a wild nature, so they keep running off. I went through tons of sketches of what the, the hero could look like, and we decided that we wanted it to be a, a, a yeti of some kind. We, we ended up picking like a head from one concept, the, the body from another, the hair from another, and then we just sort of all put it together in a jigsaw. The big difference with Candy Crush Jelly Saga is that it adds a competitive element where you play against the Jelly Queen and Cupcake Carl and you really want to win against them. So you've got to put a foot down really and say, you know, enough is enough. You cannot cover the world in jelly. <laughs>